What science fact everyone should know? Water expands when it freezes. Sharks cannot swim backwards. Science exists to try to prove itself wrong. The Earth is expected to be absorbed, and therefore destroyed, by the Sun, having expanded into a red giant, in 7, 59 billion years. You can just buy a lab coat, they aren't special. Killer whales are not really whales, they are dolphins. If you take all the world's mammals, that is every single one, and line them up end to end which could be from the top of their head, to the bottom of their feet, or tip of nose to end of tail or fin, line them each up in that way, in outer space, they will all die. We do not know if sun still exists, we can reasonably argue that it does, but we do not know for absolutely sure, all we can say for sure it existed and was doing fine 8 minutes and 20 seconds ago as that is the time light needs for the distance. Antibiotics only are for bacterial infections. Vaccines are safe. There are microorganisms parasites capable of hijacking an ant's neural system and making them climb a blade of grass over and over until they are ate by sheep. This allows the parasites to reproduce in the gut of the sheep and then flow out of the sheep's excrement. It begs the question, what else that cannot be seen by the naked eye makes us act with self-destructive behavior? If all the planets were placed next to each other, they can fit in the space between the Earth and the Moon. I always found that interesting and non-political. Laws of thermodynamics, so many theories actually contradict them. Not really a science fact, but I personally use Occam's razor quite a lot, basically says that the simplest answer is usually the correct one. How do I apply this concept? Whenever I see some fake news claiming that the people are out to get you I ask myself why would they do that, how exactly, etc. For example you have people claiming that there are microchips in vaccines. Now this is a load of ballocks simply because they do not have to inject microchips in our bloodstream they already have a tool called smartphone that has a microphone and cameras and GPS location. When global warming is described as warming 2 degrees Celsius, that is the average increase at the equator, due to physics, that increase gets more extreme as you go closer to the poles so too at the equator is about 12 at the same latitude of Canada or the UK. This is going to be a fact that gets more and more important in the coming decades. The Earth is round not flat. No matter the gender get to know your bits, upstairs and downstairs, knowing which lumps have always been there and which are new, look for skin changes too, men can have breast cancer too, so no matter which you identify with, check your stuff on the regular. It's not really a single fact but I believe everyone should be aware of the Human Genome Project, very simplified it aimed at mapping out all human genes results from that were incredible turns out we have roughly 20, 500 genes, which is significantly less than Rice has. That project is one of the most influential bits of research on our kind with immense consequences for our understanding of humans and even the way we research them. The project officially ended in 2003, that means it's likely it happened in your lifetime. It surely happened in mine, which really gets me excited. I met some people that learned about it in school, but I met far more that have never heard of it. To the latter look it up, it's a scientific breakthrough that is currently shaping the world. Anyone can be, or perhaps has been, a scientist as long as you practice the scientific method, identify a problem, form a hypothesis theory, test your hypothesis, analyze the results draw a conclusion, does not need to be math oriented, could be used to find a faster route to work or learn how to word emails to not piss off your co-workers. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Scientists say there are over 3 billion base pairs of DNA in human genes and over 25,000 genes in the human genome. A copy of that genome exists in each of the 10 trillion cells in the human body. If all of that DNA were lined up, 
It would cover the distance between Earth and the Sun 100 times. Not really a fact but pretty cool how many things there are in just one human body. We have pictures from the surface of Venus. If a magnetor were to enter our solar system, its gravitational pull would be strong enough to rip the atoms from our bodies. One way of comparing the size and distance of the Earth and the Sun would be to separate a grain of sand and a basketball by 8 miles. On Earth it trains water, on Saturn and Jupiter it trains diamonds. Birds are the living descendants of Thropod's carnivorous dinosaurs. So don't eat trust em. Run em over binge on Swiss chalet. KFC or whatever let em know that we re the captain now. You are the rarest thing in the world. What I am saying is, you are the one to reach the finish line of being born, like a race. So you got lucky, first place reward, most likely living a horrible life. The Earth is not flat. Vaccines do not cause autism and stem cells are not pumped intravenously into the bloodstream to kill you. The universe expands faster than the speed of light. The fact that on the sun's surface there is a temperature of 6000 degrees Celsius, but in the core it is suddenly 17 million degrees Celsius. Black holes are dense planets consuming stars, and or tidally locked planets eclipsing a star. The glamour of the idea has gave them this otherworldly vibe. It is far more simpler than it has been projected. One three million Earths could fit inside the Sunday. One of the most difficult physical phenomena to compute is actually how water and other fluids flow. Consider subscribing if you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more of Reddit Universe.